Member here, and from the behalf of our Africa for Africans tour group, our Ghana May 2022, we want to donate these school supplies to Trinity Home Academy, an organization that we've been working with since 2007 on our second Ghana Journey of a Lifetime, and now this is our 21st Ghana Journey of a Lifetime. So, in between the beginning to now, we have every time we have a journey in Ghana, we have always made sure that we come up here and show love. The original administrator that organized. This operation, Mama Sophia, literally somebody I respect to the highest level. Our elder literally went out there and if children were homeless or lost or certain things, she would organize them and she she put things together to where they can operate in an orphanage. And that was literally about two miles down from where we, you know, where we walk at, close to where we walk at. And then this property is a little bit newer, but from all of the contributions, donations from our group, other groups, and our sister, elder, working together to try to get people to put money together. She has built a nice academy. And as we did our tour today, you know, it has went from literally an orphanage to an academy. And these are the things that uh, you know, we have to support. We have, you know, we, we, we have to look at the fact that our children, we need to just focus more on taking care of them because we have so much more children now than before in the world as we have this growing African continent. And that puts put us in a good position to build a, a strong future. So the donations, the dedication of what we've been doing and other people are doing have changed the focus of things to where now this place is just growing and growing. And soon you, you come by in the future, you know, it's going to look a lot better. Because what you saw, you saw the technology room. Things, those things weren't there. And all of these buildings, little by little, have come up. So I just wanted to show people literally if you want to make a difference, come to Africa and donate your resources directly to the source and let's build together. My elder administrator, appreciate you inviting us and sister uh, Gifty, appreciate you. Would you like to say anything? Oh, really, um, we really thank you. We thank you all for being here, for always supporting our mother even when she was alive. Thank you as you all, you, you, you've seen, you, we've taken you around and we've seen where your donations are going to, into. We really appreciate and we look forward to seeing more and more support from you all. Thank you. Absolutely, so family, I keep it rolling. So family, what I want to do is I'll take a bucket and then we're going to put some financial donation in it. And, and we like to just donate the money in a pile while we're here. Yes, family. So, family, uh, literally, this is the things that we do, and we want to just literally just show you a practical connection. Thank you very much. And we have to start putting these things in perspective if we're going to build something strong together. And you know, what we're also showing you is that African diaspora, African continent connection, stolen Africans returning home, being impactful. Thank you. So, family, while you're watching this, you can link us directly. Check out our website, africaforafricans.org. And if you have anything that you'd like to send when we're traveling to whichever country, you can always uh, mail it to me. I uh, can always just give you a mailing address, or if you're in Georgia, we can always connect. So family, the journey of a lifetime continues. And just want to show you some more view of our children and our supplies, and just the wonderful energy that we have here. And we literally just got to Ghana yesterday, family, our group. And since we've been here, you know, we made sure we make one of these major stops. And that's how dedicated we are, family.